Yeah, I've, I've also attended this forum every year. I find it exciting, interesting place to have new ideas, exchange ideas, but most importantly, networking. And um, we look at problems of our country to drive the economy and the role we can all play as uh, players. But the, the, the unfortunate thing is that every year we talk about the same problems. So we know what the issues are, we know what the problems are. The key thing for us is to have an action plan of how we need to tackle these problems. And uh, we all have roles to play in different, in different areas. For me, my challenge is how do I produce the skills? How do I pre prepare people for tomorrow's job? both in the private sector the pub and the public sector. And now we're actually also looking at the social space because we need these three legs to drive any development. Well, Jack Ma is a reality. They're not going to stop it. The young ones, there are two things driving the Jack Ma syndrome today in Nigeria. One is shortage of global talent. There's a war for talent. There's a battle for talent. They're looking for talents all over the world. So you can't stop talent from, move, from moving from one place to the other. Yeah. The second is that the young ones feel shortchanged. Mm -hmm. That our leaders and the country are not treating them well, and that's where they're living. So they are too, for me, I am not worried. Actually, it's a good thing for us. Mm -hmm. So my challenge is how do I produce more talents that I can ship out there to different parts of the world? So we have the population, so I need more funds for me to produce more MBAs, more talents that can go there, not just work in Nigeria, but work anywhere in the world. Because they have two advantages for us. One, they also improve their own level of skill, but at the same time, they move money back. They have their family to look after here. So that's for remittance could also be an interesting thing for us in terms of our own development. So I, I wouldn't want to be seen as going against it, rather I'm all for it. Definitely. And I'm sure many CEOs will not like me for that. Definitely.